One of the things I, I think is so exceptional about the Brahms Violin Concerto is that it has such a, a welcoming opening. It's so subtle, it just has this, this gentle um, undulating feel from the horns and the lower strings before it really builds up into the surge. And I, I kind of feel like that's a nice metaphor for our season. As a matter of fact, I think the whole concert is great in that way because the Brahms Violin Concerto invites us in, presents this dazzling display. The Tchaikovsky Patatique Symphony presents the dazzling display and then tapers off to the end. And I, I feel like it invites our audience in and then it portends the future. The Violin Concerto is definitely more of a symphonic piece, and so Augustine Hadley, who will be our guest artist, the sound that he gets out of his instrument really functions well to blend with the orchestra and then at the same time really um, kicks the sound out into the audience. So it's really a perfect piece for him. looking forward because I had concert masters who are some of the most critical people and principal oboes and other instruments that are featured in this piece say if you're going to play Brahms you have to do it with Augustine. I think everybody that knows the Tchaikovsky Sixth knows that the big, the big high point is at the end of the third movement, and you really want to clap, and then there's this, then there's this kind of denouement at the end, at, with the movement kind of tapering away. I think it's always interesting to feel how the orchestra and audience will react in terms of the tension in the hall, about how how people will keep the the, um, just that, that sense that the piece is going on, even though there's this, there's this kind of halt. There's always these little things from a performer standpoint, I think, well, will we all collectively be able to maintain the tension that's required to really pull this piece off for its full effect. But I think the pairing of the two pieces is really potent, and I just like, I like the soft ending, I like that it moves us into the next series of concerts and makes us anxious for the next event.